The senator, who is the committee chairman on the Federal Capital Territory, FCT, contested on the platform of the People's Democratic Party, PDP, for a third term in the March 28 election. He came second with 38,148 votes behind Honorable Dino Malayi of the All Progressive Congress, APC, who scored 41,120 votes and who was eventually declared winner by INEC. Apparently not satisfied with the outcome, Senator Adeyemi headed to the tribunal where he filed a petition. In the petition, he declared that after collecting the certified true copy of the result sheet from INEC, he discovered from the document that about 4,000 valid votes he scored were not recorded at the collation center, even though the votes were approved, recorded and stamped from the warden units across Kogi West Senatorial District. If votes were recorded, but they're not counted, you have every reason to ask questions. So we are here to simply fight this suit, that we have 75% documentary evidence to prove this case. Senator Deyemi is seeking an order for the withdrawal or nullification of the certificate of return already issued to the APC's Dino Melayi. The petitioner also alleges that Onobu Melayi was not qualified as at the time of the election to contest for the Kogi West Senatorial District by reason of substantial non-compliance with the provisions of the Electoral Act 2010 as amended. Amongst other prayers, the Senator is also seeking the disqualification of Mr. Malai as a candidate for the elections. In an interview with Channel's television in Lokoja, the Senator-elect Mr. Dino Malai said the allegations and the petition is a way of ventilating failure. The election was very peaceful, but if anybody is complaining, you, can't, you don't expect that when you beat a child, you expect the child to cry. It's a way of ventilating um, failure. Attention will now shift to the tribunal which has received the petition. No date has however been fixed for its hearing. <laughs>